Oh my gosh, I've gained a lot of weight. Next time I ask for a snack, tell me no, okay? Okay. Babe, can you DoorDash me an Eminem McFlurry, please? No. Do you even love me? Anyone that thinks they're stupid, stand up. Oh, so you think you're stupid? No, I just felt bad that you were standing alone. No! On average, how long would you say you spend on your phone? Um, probably like seven or eight hours. Oh, that's really good. That's actually the average per week. Luke, here's hundred dollars for the chores that you did this month. Wait, I have a proposition for you. If you can guess my riddle correctly, I'll give you this back. But if not, you have to double it. You should not have said that. Deal. What starts with F, ends with F, but doesn't have an F in it? Starts with an F, ends with an F, but doesn't have an F? That's impossible. Keep thinking. I'll give you five more seconds. <sighs> no, it can't be that because that has an F. I don't know. What is it? Photograph. <laughs> This is gonna be your first solo flight. Just remember everything I've taught you, okay? Okay, I'm excited. Also, stay on the phone with me because every thousand feet, I'm gonna to talk to you just to make sure you're doing all right. Good luck. Here I go. You're at a thousand feet. You're doing great. I'd say you're around 2,000 feet now and it looks amazing. 3,000's coming. Are you okay? What went wrong? At 2,500 feet, I started to get cold, so I turned off the big fan. No! coffee? Yes, I do. How many per day? Usually three. And how much do you pay per coffee? Five dollars each. How long have you been drinking it? Uh, about 20 years. Three coffees per day equals $450 per month or $5,400 per year. In 20 years, that's $108,000. Yeah, sounds about right. Did you know if you put that money in a savings account that after interest, you'd have enough money to buy a plane? Do you drink coffee? No. Then where's your plane? Bye, Michael. Bye, Jeffrey. Bye, Ava. Thanks for the year, Mrs. Thomas. You could have taught me better, but I passed, so it doesn't matter. <sighs> no more Lou Davidson! Hey, I forgot to introduce you to my little brother. He's gonna be in your class next year, and he's just like me. Oh! There's a bear! Oh no! We're gonna die! What are you doing? That's not gonna help you outrun the bear, you know. Yeah, I know. I don't have to outrun the bear. I just have to outrun you. No! I'll be at lunch right now! Eyes on the target. Yes, sir. The person on the right. He is my son. You are to protect him at all cost. He's my only son. Hello? 
Oh, hey man. Thanks for that investment tip last month. I invested all my savings into it. Really? Yeah, you got me so excited on it that I even sold my house and moved back in with my parents so I could invest even more money into it. Well, when I told you about that, I wasn't recommending it. What do you mean? You did say it made you a millionaire, right? Yes, but I used to be a billionaire. Please go over to my friend's house. Ask her. No, please don't tell me to ask mom. She's gonna say no. Well, it looks like you already know your answer. <sighs> but dad. Sorry. How about this? If you fail my riddle, you have to take me. Nope. Why? Are you not smart enough? No, that's not what I said. Fine. Let's do the riddle. Okay. Repeat after me. Red. Red. Blue. Blue. Yellow. Yellow. What color is grass? Green. I told you to repeat after me. Thank you so much for coming. Can you try to fix my computer, please? Fixed. So what was wrong? It was an ID10T error. An ID10T error? What is that? Just in case I have to fix it again. Haven't you heard of an ID10T error before? No. Write it down, and I think you'll figure it out. Oh! Hey mom, if you can guess what I wrote on my hand, I'll give you a hundred dollars. Okay, um, money. Try again. Luke? Try again. Pizza? Try again. Milk? Try again. McDonald's? Try again. Fortnite? Try again. I don't know. What does it say? It says, try again. Oh! Good morning from Mexico. I had my leg wrapped up because I accidentally backed into my scooter's exhaust. I had a busy day, so I jumped out of bed and went through this maze of a closet into the bathroom and had a shower. Then I hopped on my friend's scooter and we went on a rescue mission because the day before, I got a flat tire on mine. It was pouring rain when it happened though, so we waited for the next morning to deal with it and I ended up having to pay for a new tire. Then we walked down the busiest street and got some lunch, hopped in a taxi, and made it to explore. Unfortunately, I couldn't bring my camera because I didn't have a strap, so this is the only video I got. When we got back, I went up to the rooftop of our place because I wanted to fly my drone and look at this amazing cinematic shot I got. Opa! Opa! I have no clue what that word means, but they kept yelling it. This place has got to be my favorite restaurant here. It just keeps getting crazier and crazier as the night goes on. And everybody gets on their chairs and starts waving around their napkins, and then we all smash plates. After the plate smashing, we ended off the night on this rooftop with some music. Luke, Auntie just got here from the airport, and I'd like you to come meet her new baby. Oh, okay. Oh my goodness, you've grown so much since I saw you last. Yes, I did. <laughs> the baby looks so cute. How old is he? Thank you. He's 23 weeks old. Huh? She must be messing with me. Oh, I lost track of time. Can you tell me what time it is, Luke? Oh, yeah, of course. It's 5,321 seconds past two. Oh! You know what time it is? Uh, it's eight o'clock. Thank you. Have a great night. <sighs> what? Hey, do you happen to know what time it is? <sighs> it's 8.15. Thanks. Have a good one. <sighs> That's it. What? I don't know what time it is. I know. That's why I knocked. It's 8.27. Yo, this is your son's kidnapper. My son? One, two. All my kids are here. No, you're missing one. I am? 
Yes, look. I just sent you a picture. Oh, I forgot about him. Yeah, so back to what I was saying. If you don't give me $100,000 by tomorrow, your son will die. What the? <laughs> I told you. Where the heck even are we? I've got no clue and I'm even looking at the map. Why don't we ask that guy down there? Hey sir, where are we? You're in a hot air balloon. <laughs> He's definitely a math teacher. <laughs> Why do you say that? Well, first of all, it took him a while to come up with an answer. Second of all, the answer is logical. And third of all, is completely useless. Oh!